so the question is what is iot explain in detail on genesis of iot which is asked for 8 marks in the year 2022 that is july august 2022 question paper okay so your question consists of two parts what is iot and explain in detail the genesis of iot so uh, what is iot can carry two marks and uh, remaining six marks will go for the genesis of iot so in what is iot you can focus on uh, the definition and the goal of the iot okay so what is the definition of iot iot can be defined as a technology transition in which the devices will allow us to sense and control the physical world by making objects smarter and connecting them through an intelligent network okay and what is the goal of your iot what is the main goal connect the unconnected okay so these two points and you can just elaborate it what is meant by connect the unconnected this means that the objects that are not currently joined to a computer network namely the internet will be connected so that they can communicate and interact with people and other objects okay so when objects and machines can be sensed and controlled remotely across a network a tighter integration between the physical world and the computer is enabled this allows us for the improvements in the areas of efficiency accuracy automation and the enablement of the advanced applications so uh, this much you can write it for what is iot which carries uh, two marks now remaining six marks will be split to the uh, genesis of iot so moving on to the next slide we are talking about the genesis of iot it is nothing but the origin of the iot so you can start off with the person credited with the creation of the term internet of things is kevin ashton while working for procter and gamble in 1999 kevin used this phrase to explain a new idea related to linking the company supply chain to the internet now you can uh, plot the uh, diagram where your x axis consists of intelligent connections and y axis consists of its impact in the biz business and society that is business and societal impact versus your intelligent connection so what was your uh, 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 connections so we can split it into four phases phase 1 is your connectivity phase 2 is your network economy phase 3 is your immersive experience and phase 4 is your internet of things okay and each phases uh, of uh, each phases of the genesis of iot was built over the previous one okay so for example you have the first phase the first phase began in the mid 1990s okay 1990s and the first phase is called as the connectivity and in this case uh, the access was completely digitized for example email web browser search moving on to the next phase slowly it was uh, the next phase was called as your networked economy in, in which the business was digitized digitized business by means of uh, you have e-commerce digital supply chain and collaborations next you have the third phase that is your immersive experience where you have uh, the person to person interactions were digitized uh, so such as social mobility cloud and video so mainly emergence of social me uh, media okay and uh, the last phase was your uh, internet of things where you are digitizing the world wherein you are connecting the people process data and things so this uh, diagram can carry three marks remaining three marks can go for the explanation so moving on to the next slide you can just elaborate um, the evolution of the inter uh, internet can be categorized into four phases each of these phases had a profound in impact on our society and our lives these four phases are further defined in uh, that you can give the table so internet phases and definitions so first one as we have shown in the diagram previous diagram connectivity that is digitized access this phase connected people to email web uh, services and search so that information is easily accessed the second phase was your network economy where you have digitized business this phase enabled e-commerce and supply chain enhancement along with collaborative enga engagement to drive increased efficiency in business processes and your third phase is your immersive experiences where you have digitized interactions 
this phase extended the internet experience to encompass widespread video and social media while always being connected through mobility more and more applications are moved into the cloud and the last one uh, phase is called as your internet of things that is digitize the world this phase is adding connectivity to objects and machines in the world around us to enable new services and experiences it is connecting the unconnected so these uh, three slides uh, contents of the three slides can be written for total 8 marks